And finally, question 11. So again, we've got two complex numbers, sorry, two loci, complex loci, that we've got to establish what they are and then solve them simultaneously. So same again, different starting point. So question 11. A, first of all, we have the modulus of Z, take 3, add 2i equals 4. Take out the negative. So we've got a circle, center, 3, minus 2, radius 4. Um, write down straight away what the Cartesian equation of that is. So you're going to have x take 3 squared plus y plus 2 squared equals 4 squared. Equation 1. Then the second locus is arg z minus 1 equals minus pi by 4. of z minus 1 plus naught i equals minus pi by 4 half line center 1 naught angle pi by 4 below because it's negative so it's going to turn that way right let's do a little sketch I love sketching these circles right so I've got a Cartesian circle center 3 minus 2 radius 4 so that's going to take me 1, 2, 3, 4 that way, 2 that way, 1, 2, 3, 4 that way, and 1, 2, 3, 4 that way. So my circle is going to do that kind of thing. Perfect. And my half line is going from 1, 0. and is going like that. So that's the point that I'm looking for there. Right, the Cartesian equation. Well, the gradient is going to be minus one because it's uh, 45 degrees in the other direction. So it's going to be y minus, and I know that it's going through this point here, which has got a y zero. So y equals minus x plus one. Equation two, and I'm interested in that point there. So what I now need to do is to substitute this into there. So sub for y in 1 x minus 3 squared plus minus x plus 1 oops plus 2 squared equals 16. Okay so let's um, work out what we've got here now. Let's expand the brackets. So I'm going to have here um, x squared minus 6x plus 9. And this has become um, 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 3 minus x all squared. So out of here I'm going to have 9 minus 6x plus x squared 
equals 16. Tidy things up, I got 2x squared minus 12x plus 18 plus 9 plus 18. Well, 16 2x squared minus 12x plus 2 equals 0 x squared minus 6x plus 1 equals 0 right so I'll do this by completing the square so inside the bracket is going to be a minus 3 um, that's going to give me a plus 9 that I don't want so I have to take 9 out of there so I'm going to have x minus 3 all squared equals 8 from there I'll have um, x minus 3 is plus or minus root 8 so x equals 3 plus or minus root 8. Now, if you take a look at um, where we, that point is there, it's quite clear 3 is there. So from argon diagram, x is going to be plus root 8 and then if we put that into equation 2 to find the y coordinate y will be minus so what have we got there we're going to have um, minus 2 minus root 8 or y equals minus 2 plus root 8 so my complex number at p there is going to be z equals x is 3 plus root 8 minus i 2 plus root 8 which looks awful but is the right answer so there you go